connection with NetBeans and MySQL is a two-phase process. First of all, you have to click on Window, Menu, and then select your services. At the left-hand pane, there is a lots of action: database, web services, servers, and all that things. First of all, you have to make sure whether your MySQL server is registered with services or not. If not, check out these options. Here is admin properties local host servers root is the default username and here is the main administrative password which i have already supplied here second thing is check the admin properties here these properties these locations are compulsory by default mysql automatically set all these properties and here goes okay Now, MySQL is now registered and it is running. How to check it is running or not? Right click on your MySQL server and here you can see it is stopped. So, it's already been running. Now it's time to connect or make a new connection. Here, two connections are already been there. One is samples and second is on test database. If you want to create a new connection on any oh, oh, oh. right here goes create database and here is start stop connect refresh administrative properties here comes new connections by default Java comes with your Java DB embedded so here my aim is to connect with my SQL connectors so this is connection and the previous was step was to register my SQL with java click on next and here goes my SQL remember here previous two connections are on sample database and test database my third database is my SQL here again goes to your main password supply your password and check your connections if everything goes perfectly then you will see this message connection succeeded otherwise you will receive some sort of error message like this here so check out all these settings and do not forget to click on remember password if everything goes fine then you will be able to see your new connections here sure